This morning I've nipped out incognito to Leroy Merlin. Anna doesn't know what's going on. She's only going to see this in the edit. But there was something I saw Anna pick up when we went to Ikea and Leroy Merlin. And I thought that is a great idea. It was a little bit expensive, but it was a great idea. And that was up lights for the main building. I did have some kind of cheap up lights that uh, were going to go on the edge of the um, concrete. But I was thinking they're just going to get in the way when you're trying to cut the grass and things like that. So when I saw Anna pick them up, I kept my mouth shut. Um, and I thought, I'll come back, have a look at that another time. So let's see what I've got. So here we go. This is the product. You can see my hands, fairly big hands, but this is a massive up light. And the nice thing is it's E27 bulbs. So they're just normal household bulbs, screw, uh, like kind of, rather than bayonet, the screw fittings, yeah? And um, they fit in what can be described as a bucket, a bit like those uh, other ones, the small ones. And then this is orientable. So with this little kind of fitment here, we can orientate the, uh, the light shown in the photo there. So of course the majority of that is under the concrete and all we see is this bit. If we want to orientate it, it'll be slightly raised. Um, so yeah, really nice product. And I've got two from this Leroy Merlin. I'm going to pick up another three from another Leroy Merlin and order one more. And I think Anna is going to be really, really happy when she sees these in place. Um, we're not there yet, but, um, you know, they're really good. <laughs> So I've just arrived in a pretty cold uh, Villeneuve. Uh, the pool guy is here, but hopefully he'll be able to do something because it's a bit chilly and damp. Let's see how we're doing. You can see the gas bottle just there. And you can see the mountain bucket. Not sure what that's doing there, but probably useful. And I think, I think they're going to check if it's like cured before they start the painting part. And obviously there's Ed going about. Bernard and his sons weren't there, but he did say to me that every time when he goes to do a job, he likes to have to go and eat out and then come and do the work. So we think he's just across the road at the, there's, there's like a Spanish restaurant over there. We think he's just there eating. So, but then he deserves it. I mean, it's pretty cold. And the end of the day, we need, we need to be slightly warmer before he starts painting. I'm gonna go and check what Ed is up to because I know he's trying to finish off the cave whilst we still have cereal and then after we're going to be doing other things but I just want to, want to see what he's up to so let's go let's go and check what Ed and Cyril have been up to it's looking good hi Ed Anna. How are you doing? I see you've started the tiling. Yeah. My back's giving me jip, so I've had to put my uh, my back brace on. Cyril's gone for his lunch and I just wanted to try and get on a bit. I say get on a bit, it will be a bit because I can lay literally one more tile and then I've got those uh, spots to put in. Oh, they're going to look good. Look can you do me a favour? Can you pass sure. me... Um, pass me the um, trowel. Spatula, spatula. Yeah, spatula. trowel there, mm -hmm. and the bucket with the mix. Yeah, of Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know whether you remember this last time. Little change of, well, I 
changed my mind, but also I didn't know that what, how things would be done. So now this is where we're gonna have a spot instead of a sticking out line. And I think that's gonna make a big difference. Anna. Yes. If people are gonna send you gifts, yeah? Yes. Get using them. Right? I John and John and Roxanne sent you these and you just passed me that without your gloves on. I know because I just thought I'd just be doing something. They're quick. not to look pretty. Well, they do look pretty, but they're not they, for they looking look a, pretty. They look really good. Get your gloves on. Okay. Um, so, we're down to the last few days of Cyril as well. I know. That's what I was thinking as well. Uh, where was I? There. But, I've got some good news. Oh, what's that? Well,. I've had somebody in mind for the job for a while, yeah? Yeah, oh, that's good. And uh, I've even given the, the worker a bit of a trial. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, before I go any further, I got you a little present. Oh, thank I'm you. I'm going to just get on with this. Thank you, Ed. Let me just... Now, I love the way yes. you put the tripod on the tile I was going to use. What, how, how was I meant to know that? Wow. I'll get you another one, don't worry. <laughs> I can't yeah. open this. I'll tell you what, I'll open that for you. <laughs> Thank you. And you get me a tile, but put your other glove on because I don't want you hurting your hands. Okay, I'll get you another tile. Okay. Are they there heavy? you go. Yeah, bet. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, let's see. What you got me? So when you pass me these tiles, uh -huh. you need to make sure that you pass me them face up, yeah? Okay. Because that's the Fit. side that was cut and that's the okay. polished side, okay? Okay. Uh, oh, wow, on. this is a bit colourful. Is this... Did you get me something to wear? <laughs> yeah, you know why? Why? You've got the job. No! <laughs> You've got it. It's your job, Anna. There's no better job in the world than my assistant. I'm not sure that's a good job, Ed. The good husband I am. Uh -huh. I know your size, so I've got you an extra small. Thank you, Ed. That's very thoughtful. That's well, super. I mean, I, I don't want to be cold. I'm going to have to wear it with le leggings underneath. I, yeah, you wear it over the top of your clothes and overall. Oh, okay. Listen. But then, I don't think... Don't, <laughs> don't keep them waiting. They want to see you in your new overalls. I put them on with purple. Could you not have gotten me grey or black? I thought a nice feminine colour for you. <laughs> well, thank you for the present. I don't know. I don't know about the job, though. I think. I think we'll see. It's not every day you're offered a new job, Anna. <laughs> Beggars can be choosers. Yeah, tell me about it. Okay, well I'll go and put. <laughs> <laughs> I go and put my. My new outfit. Okay, thanks Thank assistant. You. Now get off my tile. Thank you. In all the excitement, I put... Too much? No, I'll just put it a bit close. Uh, it's okay. Uh, oh. Do you know how long I've been keeping that on a secret? I don't know. I'm surprised you managed to keep it a secret. That's why you were asking me if you received post every day. Yes. Normally, I'd be doing a long line of these, whizzing them down and... Where was I going from there? So there. there and... So yeah, it's stuck there, I need to work work on that first and then this. So I'm going to just clean up and uh, 
There's some cutting. Yeah, what are you waiting for? Okay, I'm going to get changed. I mean, put this on top. I just need your help on this, Anna, because okay. when I was drilling the hole here, mm -hmm. the drill slipped from where I was drilling and it touched the uh, kind of trunking around the outside. So I'm going to pull on that and I need you to just hold it and make sure it doesn't go down the hole. Okay. But I still need to be able to pull. There. Okay. Thankfully, there was a bit excess there. Keep going. Mm -hmm. Do you need more? Yeah. That's good. Okay. So look, it had touched it as well. It's a good job we had excess because that now means that that's not a problem. Can you see where it touched it? Oh yeah, I can just get that. Ah. There. Oh, that's good. Yeah. All right, let's get on with digging this out. Now, why could you not have gotten me these, which looked far easier than these, where I'm just struggling to get them right? I wanted to keep you warm, Anna. It's very kind of you. I could have got you a bandana. <laughs> I, th I think I'm good. And, and look, you could have made that pose with the drill. <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> I, th I don't think that's very me, but yes, sure, I could have. Don't worry, Valentine's round the corner, I know what to get you, Ed. Oops. Typical. It ain't two o'clock yet. He's gone for his lunch and he did tell me that he has a good lunch and then he works in the afternoon. He doesn't work mornings. He told me that he has a good lunch has a good drink with his lunch and then sleeps in the afternoon quite a bit. What? Well, I think they say like a glass a day keeps the doctor away. One thing's for sure, is going to be all over you with those new work <laughs> pants, Anna. I don't think so. I think he's a gentleman. Oh. I don't think he's like that. Plus, I think, how, how are you doing, Ned? Because we're still on dry January. I know you're, you've been really... Do you want to get on my bad side again, Anna? No, I'm good. I just <laughs> want to annoy you a bit more. <laughs> Oh, annoy you a bit more. Well, I just wanted to annoy you. Not annoy you. I'm actually proud of you, but it's just I don't know how you're doing it. Yeah, I don't know how you're doing it. Just a glass of wine a day. That neighbour keeps on competing with you, Ed. How dare he or she? Because we don't know. I mean, uh, or the gardener. Yeah, I think it's the gardener again. But... Um, <clears throat> the cave is, is looking good. It is slightly trickier because I ch those lights that I chose, you have to go deep and dig out and then they're rounded. So, and then with rectangular tiles. Yeah, the actual, the actual electric side of things, the actual design of it is rubbish but which made it really hard for me to fit the two lights but i've managed to kind of get through that get them in um, and then the tiling was really slow because i had to cut around them and your assistant isn't really used to bringing tiles down and but no. i'm gonna learn bit by bit i might yeah. be more helpful tomorrow to, to be honest we didn't get through much um tile adhesive today that's generally <laughs> a bad sign um but yeah it's it's going to go quite quick tomorrow hopefully and we'll get that rattled out tomorrow because it's only cuts on either side well S so long as my calculations are right and i end up with a full tile at the start of the room as such so neighbor is doing noise but yeah. you <laughs> can't advance with the work <laughs> So we're laughing, but inside we're sad because the weather isn't with us. So we can't do the... Well, we've done the resin. Well, Bernard and his two sons have done the resin. 
but we can't do the painting because it's uh, well the the gel coat because we've not got the sun. No, which is a shame, and we're really looking forward to see these guys in action. But hopefully next time, really soon. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're going to save it for a before and after video, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to save it for a before and after. The full, full effect really soon. As soon as we have the good weather with us. Thank you so much, Bernard and guys. <laughs> the neighbor is competing, but... Yeah. Well, we didn't get done what we wanted to get done, did we? Well... No, but the, the cave is advancing, although it's harder because there's a lot of cuts and those lights that sadly I chose, so it's, they're, they're harder to put in. Now it's going to go a lot quicker. I'm hoping that by the end of the day tomorrow that's all finished. Yeah, and then yeah. Bernard couldn't continue. Yeah, that's a bummer because I really wanted this finished. Quite happy though because it's pretty chilly and um, okay. he said I've got to fill it full of water as soon as it's finished you know obviously once the gel coats dry so um, basically you could all, you're gonna have to wait for my swim in, in in the cold cold January well it's gonna be February water now isn't it so yeah well everyone's gonna wait so for the time being I, I rest. lucky escape yeah I'm, I'm quite good for the time being but it is gonna it is gonna be a chilly one when that's full of cold oh water. yes Oh yes. And the big reveal will have to wait as well. So that'll, I yeah. don't even think it's going to be next week, you know. No, because they, they're saying it's going to be rainy next week. He says, no problem though. It, it quickly dries up the rain on, on, the, uh, on the resin. He said, the most important thing is we've got the resin in and, the, uh, and it's no longer the... The uh, concrete. The concrete, yeah. I was talking to his son about his technique for doing, because actually build the pool too. And, um, and they don't even use these blocs branches the, the, and pour concrete in. They just do posts every so often and oh. a ring at the top and a ring at the bottom. Oh, uh, well each to their own, but I prefer the system I've done. I find it's a lot more stronger than what they're doing. I'd prefer to go over rather than under on concrete and steel, to be fair. Yeah, no, that's the best hmm. thing to do. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Thank you. 